I'm Cassie and I'm here with Abby today and we're going to be doing Party Perfect Skin with a Perfect Red Lip. Yeah, you've got an amazing lip for a red lip. Do you normally wear red? I do sometimes. Yeah. Yeah, I do. Yeah. Spice it up a bit. Everybody's doing contouring and highlighting, particularly when it's party contour. season. Yes. Okay, <laughs> let's do it then. I'm going to start off with a little bit of primer. Now, I absolutely love doing a really big brow. You've got amazing brows. Do you normally pencil them in? I use a powder usually. Okay, have you ever blending. used like uh, the brow gel? No. It's so good, I'm going to show you how to do it. You want to draw really tiny little hair strokes. You don't want to make them too blocky at all. Sometimes I like to put quite a bit of definition in the arch of the brow, you know, just to really lift your eye. That's how I get a gorgeous fashion brow for the party look. Fab. Okay, so I'm going to move on to eyes now. Now over Abby's eyes, I'm going to use an illuminating strobe cream and all I'm going to do is smooth out the creases first and draw all over the eyelid and then use my finger to pat it out. What I will also do with this is just take it down the cheeks while I'm here. I always like to put a little bit of this over the cupid's bow as well because it gives you fuller lips. I always put it there too. Yeah, we always <laughs> want bigger lips, girls. I'm going to set it with a little bit of powder. So I'm just going to press my brush in, tap away any excess. Make sure I smooth out those creases first and actually pat the colour onto the lid. You see that's got a really nice shine to it. Now I'm going to use a little bit of this contour powder. This is a really nice contouring and highlighting illuminating palette. So I'm just going to put a little bit of definition in the contours of your eye. Use the same powder in the hollows of the cheeks so it gives you a little bit of definition here. It looks really natural. Okay, so I'm going to use the same brush that I did with my contour and just apply really lightly a little bit of highlighter there. Looking gorgeous already. I'm going to use the very, very point of this liner and almost do little dots like that, a little dot to dot. And when you join those up, it just, it looks like a root. It looks oh. like a root of your lash, so it just makes them look a, bit, a little oh, bit more accentuated. Ever. This is a real makeup artist tip for what we do on shoots. Letting all your secrets. I'm letting all my secrets out, yeah. <laughs> so you look party perfect. <laughs> Okay, we're going to move on to mascara now. Now this is a fibre mascara. So fibre mascaras are great because they have like little tiny particles in them so they grip onto the ends of your lashes and make them longer. So longer lashes is definitely the theme of this look. So this is the point that we want to set the makeup now. So I'm going to just use a translucent powder all around the T-zone because that tends to be the area where your makeup may slip off a bit quicker. So we want to set that. Right now, Abby, how do you feel about red lip? I'm nervous. <laughs> okay, how's about you apply it? Let's see how well you do. Start in the middle of your lips and then move out. Yeah, good. I think at this stage, so you don't avoid too much, give them a bit of a block together. That's it. Because most of the colour will transfer and you might find that you've got enough. You get right in the corners. Because if you're doing a lot of singing at this party night, you don't want to have gaps. <laughs> good job. Great. Now we need a blot and then a second coat. So I'm going to get you to go over the top with gloss. So I think a little bit of gloss always makes everything look a bit better. Gorgeous. You are an absolute professional with that red lip. I love it. Now I've got one last tip. It's contour. It's going crazy with contouring. So all you would do is you would draw a little line and blend it away. Or if you wanted to do down the sides of your nose, you could do. Just draw a tiny little line and blend away. If you want to sharpen up the contour in the hollow, you could just put a little bit more in there. I think you're good to go. That is it, the perfect party look. 